other than music compilations, I, I mean, when Ben and I talked, we, we couldn't really think of another product that you could make from the kind of way, the heritage of the club. I mean, you could make bits of furniture, you could make glasses and things, but that would be kind of rather gratuitous and would be entirely kind of, in a way, um, um, an object and, and nothing about life. I, I think the interesting thing about making a shoe is that it's the, it's obviously it's the, the look of the Hacienda, but it touches also the life. The Hacienda, when it opened, was one of the only clubs you could have got him wearing these. You couldn't get into a club, any other club in Manchester wearing anything like that. Yeah. Anyway, so I suppose it's, it's uh, I, I, I like the idea of it. And I mean, I must admit, I'm, uh, I'm quite sad that it did a limited edition, really. You would like it for everybody? Well, yeah, I think it'd be nice, yeah. But at the moment, there's only 250 pairs that ever... Yeah, but it does weirdly make sense, doesn't it? I mean, it's quite odd, because usually these sorts of these sorts of projects become a bit gratuitous and they just become like kind of heritage product, you know, like wedding. Yeah. You know, well, I mean, okay, again, it's a wedding mugs thing. and things like that. <laughs> um, but um, but somehow there seems some there does actually seem something strangely right about them. Yeah, completely. I mean, they, they seem to marry so many elements. It's, but yeah, it does. The, the nice really thing does. is, is that it's obviously not done for commercial reasons either. <laughs> no. <laughs> nobody's <laughs> making any money out of it, and that is another uh, amazing, uh, yeah, uh, a nice furtherance of it. Uh, you know, that and it's, it's not very, done for profit. It's not, and it's also the, the, it's also a very it's a beautiful pro product, but also coming within another beautiful. I mean, it's not just delivered to you in a normal <coughs> shoebox. It's delivered no. to you in another another specially designed shoebox. It's designed around the shape of the hacienda floor. It's, it's going to be wrapped in paper that have got that's got pictures. From the, from the club. Yeah, and it's heyday. You're doing a great sales pitch and yet there's Thank none you. to sell. In fact, actually, actually, <laughs> Miranda, the, the, it, actually there's the, the, the wrapping papers sort of have a narrative. There's, there's Ben's original floor plan, Yeah. so the, the technical diagram for, for construction, that's one of the, the um, um, wrapping papers. Then there's three or four sheets of people in the club, Kevin Cummings photographs of people in the club at its kind of, at its most hedonistic. Yeah. And then we have a photograph of the building being, being not demolished. demolished. So there's a whole kind of yeah, I mean, life it's, story. It's, it's wrap, and wrapped around those trainers. Wrapped around those trainers, yeah. Mm -hmm. And with my book, you could hold your book, have your trainers on, <laughs> have your <laughs> compilation <laughs> CD, yeah. and, and uh, watch the DVD that but I'm releasing as well. Do is do that. And die happy. What yeah. you can't do Hopefully. is do that within the Hacienda. Yeah. Well, may, well, you know, the, uh, it lives forever in our hearts.